Leo. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. I do your reading almost daily and I upload your videos right away. So these messages are current. In this reading, we are going to find out who is thinking heavily about you right now and why. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Leo, I'm still recovering from being sick, so um, please bear with me, okay? <laughs> in case I cough in the middle of the reading. Um, spirits and angels, please show me who, who is thinking heavily about Leo right now and why. Page of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Maybe this is somebody you would like to hear from, right, Leo? Or this person could be thinking heavily in regards of you wanting you to reach out to them if it's not you. <laughs> um, so we've got the Nine of Wands here. This person may have hurt you in the past. And the lovers, both of you may have been physically intimate at one point in the past or could be in a relationship. Oops, the extras. We've got the Queen of Wands. That's definitely your energy. I feel like this person is thinking heavily about you right now because they're still very much attracted to you, right? But they may have hurt you or you may have hurt them. And they definitely have their guards up right now. We've got the, or you may have your guards up in regards to them. Mm, the moon here is in my first. This person is thinking heavily about opening up communication, offering you the Ace of Pentacles, offering you something solid, could be a commitment, or giving you something, something that is of value to you. The death card here indicates both of you are no longer together, no longer are connected, at least not physically together. We've got the Queen of Pentacles here, Leo. This person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. This person is observing you, Seven of Pentacles. Wondering what had happened between the two of you, waiting, observing, ten of cups here, as I'm first. This is somebody, yeah, perhaps you were in a relationship with or you were physically intimate with this person at one point, but no longer are. I feel like either there could be trouble in paradise right now or both of you could be separated. And they're not happy. They're, they're still waiting though, seven of pentacles, this person is still waiting for you. They're thinking heavily about you. They're still waiting for you to either offer them commitment or or they, are, they could be observing and waiting to see if they would like to offer you to make a choice here with the lovers, to make a choice to offer you a commitment or to start over. That's quite indicates transformation as well, right? So something about them thinking maybe some things need to change. Maybe they need to change or this connection needs to change. And sometimes when cards are in reverse can indicate a delay, right? Ten of cups here in reverse. So they've been waiting for maybe a message from you or a choice that you need to make. Or it could be them waiting for themselves to make a choice in regards to the future for the both of you. I feel like both of you are separated right now, most likely, with the death card here. Let's see more, Leo. Yeah, you may have turned your back on this person or vice versa. Uh, page of Wands and Ten of Wands in reverse, you may have given up on this uh, person or that you may think that this person has given up on you. But I feel like this person is thinking really long and hard in regards to sending you a message. And Temperance here, I feel like it's a message of love, a passionate message, a, a message of hope as well, a message of reconciliation. And we've got the King of Swords in reverse, and also we've got the Two of Wands here. But they're indecisive, right? This person is indecisive. Um, they haven't made a decision yet. Feels like King of Swords in reverse. They're not really 100% clear. They're not telling, they're not saying anything until they're 100% clear. So this person is also thinking heavily about how beautiful you are, how gorgeous you are. It doesn't matter he or she's not gender specific. And maybe the Queen of Pentacles, they could be thinking heavily in regards of maybe you have always felt like home to them or you're 
you're the stability, you're all that, you're the most stable person or stable relationship. If it's not that, it just feels like they could be thinking heavily in regards of how maybe you have always been loyal to them. Mm -hmm. Again, it could go vice versa because this is actually your, your energy. It's fire, right? Hmm. And also, this is a general re reading. We've got the Justice in reverse, Seven of Cups, and the Six of Wands in reverse. You're not paying attention to this person right now, or that at least you're showing that you're not paying attention to this person. If that's the case, the Seven of Cups here can indicate them wondering, questioning, do you still want them? or? And also, if you haven't been talking with them or haven't replied to their messages, they could be wondering, Seven of Cups here, and Justice here is in love first. You may be thinking that this person didn't treat you well, didn't treat you fairly, but I feel like with the Seven of Cups, this person could be, this is definitely a thinking energy for me with the Seven of Cups. This person could be confused as well, or just wondering, wondering about you. Wondering if this is really over, Seven of Pentacles and the Death card here. But they think they need to reach out to you for sure, the Page of Wands, because they want this harmony to be restored between the two of you. The lovers can get also maybe they do love you. And also we've got the again the ace of pentacles here. They could be thinking about starting a new beginning with you. Or that they could be thinking about how you've started a new beginning elsewhere. You're doing something else with the Queen of Pentacles. You could be focusing on your work or you may have gotten into a new relationship. Yeah, Seven of Cups. So they could be wondering if you are with somebody right now. Hence, they could be thinking heavily about you right now. And the temperance also, you know, can indicate like somebody whom is kind, an angel, could indicate pati uh, patience as well, balance. Well, they also think that you are one in a million with Ace of Pentacles. You're precious to this person. You're valuable to this person. I keep sensing like, Mm, them seven of pentacles with the seven of cups here just try to figure something out right now in regards to you i feel like it has a lot to do with them wanting to reach out and either ask for a second chance or ask to start a relationship together i feel like they're thinking about giving you something as well ace of pentacles can be something Something that is of value to you. All right, Leo, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. First one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Second one is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done uh, for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics, different questions. Check it out if you want to. And also, I am not open for personal readings. I'm closing it for a few days. Because uh, as you guys know, I'm, st I'm still recovering from being sick. So take care, Leo. I hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading. Bye.